Now, I don't know if you've been to Wilcox before, it's a little town about an hour from here. The man in that bottom picture there is Warren Hurd. Now, not many people know much about Warren. He's kind of obscured by history. But one thing we do know is that he was with Wyatt on the Vendetta Run, and that he was there when Stillwell was killed in Tucson. There was a warrant put out for both to arrest both uh, Doc Holliday and Wyatt. He didn't get one. About 1897, though, for some reason, he leaves California and comes back to Arizona. Well, the Earps, well, Wyatt anyway, and Doc would never come back to Arizona. But he did. And the problem with him was, like his little brother Morgan, he was a hothead and a bully. He didn't have very many friends here in this area. The Earps, the Earps weren't very well liked anyway. Well, it said that a man named Pete Spence paid a man named Johnny Boyette $150 to kill Warren. Well, I think Pete Spence took a, did that because Boyette and Warner were not good friends whatsoever. They were fierce enemies. So let's go to the saloon. The headquarters saloon of the year is 1900 July 6th. Let's see what happens. Show you much appreciated. We want you to enjoy Tombstone. Thank you very much.